Hello everyone, this is Emily from EC Emily I Feeling For Some. Thank you for tuning in with Emily today. Today I'm going to give you a video on green seasoning and we're going to start doing this green seasoning. After I just did this, I want to say thank you to all my subscribers. Welcome. Thank you to my viewers. Thank you for everyone who is dropping a comment in the comments below and letting me know how much you are enjoying my channel. I thank you so much. I'm using six bundles of scallion. A bundle is about this much six bundles because i'm using six bundles of scallion i'm using double of everything else so i'm using two bundles of parsley parsley is a very great herb to have in your diet however you have to be very careful with parsley parsley lowers your blood pressure also it makes you urinate a lot it if you if you have a blood clotting problem and you're taking blood thinner you have to be careful with parsley okay this is shadow benny two bundles of shadow benny over here i have fine thyme this is fine thyme two bundles of fine thyme i have oregano two bundles of oregano and i have sage i want to tell you about sage i love putting sage in my green seasoning because sage it's it's very good for the digestive system. This will help you to not have heartburn. There are other medicinal properties to sage, but for me, why I like using sage, because when I put sage in my seasoning and I cook, I do not have heartburn. If I eat out, I am definitely gonna have heartburn. So sage will prevent you from getting heartburn and it's also good for gas. This is garlic, three heads of garlic. Garlic also lowers your blood pressure. So if you're taking medication for blood pressure, please be careful because this can lower your blood pressure. So know how much you're using in proportion. One red pepper, one green pepper. I do not use black pepper, so I'm using one hot pepper. I have two thirds of vinegar and I have two cups of water. I might use more water depending on how it works in the blender. I might use a little bit more water and I have three tablespoons of salt. I'm not advertising for anyone, but I use Bragg vinegar. And I wanna tell you something about Bragg's vinegar. Just a tip. This expiration date on this Bragg's vinegar is 2023. Be careful, I wanna show you. You see when you buy the vinegar, and test it before you take it home. You see when you shake it, it looks, you see the consistency of it? It has that cloudy look, you look at the bottom, it's clean. Let me show you on this side, it's clean. There's no particles floating all over because this is good, 2023. It's a far expiration date. If this was an expiration date of probably 2020, you would not see this consistency. You would see particles flowing, and usually that's when it goes on sale. So just a tip on when you're buying this vinegar. I'm not advertising for anybody, but this is what I use, and I'm, it should have its credit. Okay, so I'm going to wash the herbs now. I'm going to chop them up. And the next time you see me, we're gonna be blending the herbs. Stay tuned. So I washed the herbs and I started blending the herbs. Okay, I washed and chopped and I'm blending. And I'm going to pause every time I go to add some and I mix the herbs up. I put some soft, like the scallion is very soft. So I put some tough one like the like the the thyme and i'm gonna put some scallion in now with the peppers because that's softer and when we hear that noise it means that the 
the blender is working hard. So I'm going to pour the seasoning into this dish, okay? I'm going to check it to see if it's, yeah, it's, it's good. Just a little tip, this is the bowl that had the seasoning and this is the blender. I'm going to add a little water to this, just a little and shake it in here and I'm gonna season my fish. This is gonna be my seasoning for the fish for today. I'm not going to let this waste, okay? I just wanted you to see that. So we finished with the seasoning. This is our bottled seasoning. I have three bottles and just a little bit uh, more that you know extra that didn't fill a bottle this is a giveaway i promised somebody uh some seasoning so that's a giveaway and that's our seasoning so that brings us to the end of making green seasoning i thank you all so much for tuning into ec emily i feel it for some please remember to like share subscribe Put your comments in the comment section. Let me know how you feel about EC Emily I feel in for some. If there's anything you want me to make, any dish you want me to make, please put it in the comment section. Also, if you think that you know what I am going to be cooking for my next video, I want you to please put it in the comment section. If you are able to tell me what I'm what dish i'm preparing next video it means that you're watching my channel i thank you all so much i love you all so much and thank you for watching i'm feeling for some i'm just me